The 36-page dossier handed over by Pakistan has for the first time admitted that the L.E.T. carried out the Mumbai attacks. The dossier terming the Lashkar operations chief Zaki Urrahman Lakhvi as the mastermind and admitting the Pakistani nationality of Ajmal Amir Kasav along with some others is said to have been the most to have prompted India to be more accommodating with Pakistan when the Prime Minister met his counterpart in Egypt recently. Now if the dossier is any indication of the way Pakistani officials are going to proceed in the case, sources say then the charge sheet would be quite substantive. Now, Pakistan has given details on each of the accused, which includes Zarar Shah, who has been identified as the person in charge of the communications. And then there are details of proclaimed offenders like Kasav as well. Now, remember earlier, Pakistan's interior minister, Rehman Malik, had said that a trial in the case would start soon. Listen in. I have accused which have been arrested and their trial is going to commence probably next week or so because next date is on the 18th. So this is going to be transparent based on the investigation, based on the evidence which we have. We have still asked some more information because those 32 questions which we had given to India, yes, the information did come, particularly full information we received on Ajmal Kasab but information pertaining to the SIM cards, information pertaining to the calls made through the internet, and also calls made on G GPR system, the messages gone on GPR system. There is a deviation in the rec record. And for more on this big breaking story, let's now head across to Anup, who has more details on this dossier. Anup, clearly here, India has been banging its head against a stone wall. Now this dossier offering some hope that Pakistan is finally admitting to some, making some sort of concessions here. Definitely that is the case that uh, Pakistan for the first time has uh, admitted uh, the role of uh, L.E.T. in the uh, Mumbai attacks and uh, this dossier uh, which contains about 36 major pages or details of uh, uh, the militants who were uh, hand in glove in the operations of uh, uh, terrorist attacks on Mumbai was handed over to the Indian authorities uh, during the meeting the Prime Minister had in Egypt and it clearly mentions uh, uh, with photos uh, uh, the mastermind of uh, L.E.T. Mr. Zakir, uh, Zakir Rahman Lakhvi and also Mr. Zarar Shah who was uh, a computer expert and who had provided the GPS, mobile and other communication system. And uh, for the first time, the Pakistani government has admitted the fact that uh, uh, Kasab is a Pakistani national and all the charge sheets, most of them have been arrested and the Indian dossier which had been provided including the finger uh, fingerprints of uh, seven uh, uh, terrorists out of the nine and uh, uh, these details have already been provided by uh, to Pakistan and Pakistan has finally admitted the role of L.E.T. Anup, lots of lots of revelations here including admissions by Pakistan that Kasav indeed is Pakistani. Uh, let me tell you the fact, Alistair, that uh, the 36 uh, pages uh, clearly a FIR, which the Pakistani authorities have prepared uh, in respect of all this militants. It starts off uh, from uh, the number one accused, that is Hamad, I mean, uh, uh, Sadiq, who was uh, the man who f f facilitated the funds and hideouts of Mumbai terror attacks. And later, it has got uh, Mr. Lakhvi, who is a mastermind of terrorist attacks in Mumbai. And then it is uh, Zarar Shah, who was the man who is an expert of computer networks and who has provided all the GPS uh, 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 system, mobiles and the Tora phones also. And then we have uh, the others, so right from uh, uh, Mohammed uh, Amjit Khan, the LAT organizer, and uh, also uh, Mr. Shahid Gafur, who is the captain of the person who provided the boat and other facilities, and Mr. Abdul Rahman, the crew member, and another crew member uh, by name Mohammed Usman. So this contains 26, uh, 36 pages, uh, uh, which is a clear FIR, and also the, the, the dossier details provided by the uh, Indian government, and also the confession of uh, uh, Mr. Ajmal Kasab, and where he mentions that he is uh, uh, from uh, Farid Court in Okhara, and this has been uh, also confirmed with the DNA samples which have been sent, and Pakistan has finally admitted 
that uh, Kasab is a Pakistani national. And clearly lots of developments here, lots of cards falling into place. Let's also tell our viewers about how just yesterday in an exclusive interview to Times Now's editor-in-chief Arnab Goswami, the Home Minister P. Chidambaram had admitted in fact that replying to Pakistan is becoming tiresome, that it might be the last time he replies to Islamabad. The material given to the Pakistanis is good enough in any court of law to obtain a conviction against the accused. Of course, it would have to be supplemented by some investigation on Pakistan soil, yes, absolutely. which they claim to have done. And if they have done that investigation, together with the material that we have furnished, they should be able to nail the accused very quickly and bring them to justice. But I think this endless exercise is, um, is very tiresome. Mm. And I think this is the last time I perhaps will answer any questions of, from Pakistan.